Hello fellow knights, Finn here and welcome back to day 3 of the 12 days of Christmas VA edition. And again, joined with Jay Killen Gaming for this next one which is called uh, Eggnog Overload. I'm pretty sure this has something to do with milk, huh? Well then, I agree. It is what it is. So now this just seems like a regular DDLC mod. Yeah. Oh, oh this is cute. That is cute. Doki Doki Eggnog Overdrive. Yeah, with the little uh, green, with the green and red polka dots in the background. Oh, and they alternate too. It that is. That is so cool. Oh, cool. Yeah. Man, I'm beat. There were too many tests today. I had to go home and do some active stuff. I feel so stiff. Once I get home, I realize it would be nice to have some eggnog. Oh, uh, hi, Monica. Hi, Sayori. Hi, Sayori. Oh. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> I thought, okay. I thought no. I was going to do both Sayori and Monica, but okay. I mean, okay, 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 well, fine. I'll tell you what. Uh, I guess you could do yeah. Sayori and Monica. I'll do Natsuki and Yuri. Sure, sounds good. All right. I wanted to talk to you tomorrow. I'm going to bring Eggnog to the Lurcher Club tomorrow. Oh, uh, see, I dramatically turned to them. Their conversation is now top priority. He's like, you said eggnog? I'm interested. <laughs> also, Sari looks so fed up for some reason. Monica looks... Confused. Like, Monica looks yeah, confused. I'm like, what's the context here? <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, I don't know why, but okay. <laughs> she said literature club. That's room 405. Mm -hmm. Sounds tasty. I can see Cyrus' mouth drooling. Not to blame her, my saliva is dripping down to my knee. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay <food>. then. <laughs> thirsty, huh? Must be thirsty. <laughs> Clubs are oh, after man. school. That's the issue. I need a plan. I need a distraction. I start walking home. I'll ask around. I'll ask around the last ten minutes before school ends to go to the office. Not to, be cute, not to be confused with the TV show, The Office. Yeah, no. But how will, but how will Osana Sensei allow me? I mean, I won't have anything that proves I should go to the office. What, Osana Sensei? Oh, okay. Oh, I, I just thought of Osana Ajimi from Yandere Simulator for some reason. You know, that could very well be a reference. To, <laughs> that could very well be a reference to Yandere Simulator. Who knows? Maybe, oh, yeah. I know what to do. I stop my pacing towards the school gate and start walking towards the library. I'll just create a fake office pass and ask to go. What could go wrong? What could go wrong? That's it. Good idea, Finn and Killen. What? <laughs> Forgery? No! But okay. I hop onto one of the school computers and open, a word, and open up a Word file. Alright. Please allow um, Killen slash Finn to come to the office. Seems perfect. I print it out and gently place it, put it in my bag. If it looks crumpled, it might not pass. All right. Now all I need to do is wait until tomorrow. Uh, can't wait. What will happen? <laughs> the next the day. Next day. <laughs> I, ch I check the clock. It's four fifteen. My time to shine. I zip my bag and grab the fake office pass. I stand up and walk to Osana Sensei's desk. Oh, Osana Sensei? Osana Sensei? Who is it? Oh, what? What? It's Monica uh, from It's Monica from Dreams of Literature Noir. You seriously? This is this is the this is what she looked like in that mod. Yes. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh, fit, fit oh. drew, fit drew the sprite himself. Oh, fit. Oh man. Oh, okay. I'm. That's that's awesome, and even at the little uh, scribbly like effect from one of those old timey things, neat. Exactly. Oh. <laughs> Fit, if you're watching this, you outdid yourself. This is awesome. What is it? I show her the forgery. I need to go t t to the office. All right. Will we? Will you be returning? No, I'll bring my stuff. See ya. I walk out of the classroom, and the second I do, I book it towards the literature club. Alright, here we are. 
I placed one speaker, specifically the loudest one, at the end of the hall. School property is written on it so no one can mess with it. I walk back 30 feet and place another one. I walk another 30 feet and place another. Then another. And then another. The last speaker is placed <laughs> 5 feet away from the door, and all of them will, will be on full blast. Damn, that's a lot of speakers. I know. <laughs> I run to the literature club and see the locker I'll be hiding in. The time is 425. Five minutes until showtime. Oh, this is oh, this is neat. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I have Bluetooth connected to all of them. Can't wait for this. Hopefully this should work. I put I pull up extra base boost <laughs> extra base boost on you dude. <laughs> base boosted and ear rape, I suppose. Ex exactly. <laughs> Guess that'll work, sure. Time to silently, yet patiently wait. For the full immersive experience, wait five minutes before this. <laughs> okay, guys, um ear rape warning. Turn down off your volumes. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to destroy all of your ears. So lower down your volumes, people. The sound of chatting fills the halls. The sound is not deafening, but certainly loud, and not something I want to hear. I want. I learned to deal with it for the next ten minutes, because apparently it takes longer for them to show up than I thought. Oh my glob! That could have gone worse. Why does the club member limit all have to be five? That's such an odd number. It is an odd number. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seriously so close to punching a vice in the face. What a jerk. Well, some eggnog should cool us down. Monica reaches into her backpack. The fool doesn't even realize the mistake she made by getting it out. Then she pulls out two Maybe jugs? I two <laughs> jugs? What? Okay. I can barely contain my excitement. Almost jumping in the small closet I'm in. Calm down, calm down. Now is your chance. I select the first speaker and begin the massive loud sound. Here we go. Whoa. Every club member jumps, and I almost jump too by how loud it is. What? What the hell is that noise? Make it stop. It's coming from the hallway. The girls run That's into the hallway. Blash shall not Blash shall not get out yet. Whoa. That's right. This god this goddamn speaker! <laughs> what is this music? <laughs> what? I don't That's know, right. man. It was kinda weird. <laughs> she grabs him by the plug. <laughs> Natsuki, wait, Natsuki, it says it's for school use. You can unplug it. Sorry, use your brain. It's clearly not being used for that. The sound abruptly stops, which means only one thing. Time to activate the other. Oh, another one. Spin it again. They jump a bit, but they clearly have been- They clearly got used to the constant blare of pure bass in their ears. Oh, glob. <laughs> Are you actually kidding me? Spin it again. They run over to it. I'm glad I placed them so far apart. I wait for the end of the bass boost. Now's a chance. I load up the next speaker even with even more. This time, make it extra loud. I press, I press play and get out of the locker. VA Sports, I think I came. <laughs> the two jugs. Exactly. The two jugs are over there, and I quickly grab them and stuff them in my bag. I go by the door leading to the exit and slightly open it so I can hear more clearly what's going on in the hallway. This is insanity. Monica, which appears to be the club president, walks over to the plug and hangs it out. There's a slight distortion in the sound before she truthfully unplugs it, which proves they are getting more irritated and angered. 
sound I make will be overruled by the loud, by the master speaker. I look back for a second. Of course they aren't looking at me. They're toppled over, losing balance, and staring at the master speaker. Their face is full of pure terror. I make a run for it, running faster than I ever had run before. I was in the school track team for middle school, so I'm pretty fast. I make it outside, out of breath, legs on fire, the whole school is shaking, mind you. Oh no! Hey, hey, hey. But it doesn't matter. I have eggnog. I have power. I begin walking home. No, no, it's still playing! Oh, 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 it stopped. Oh, thank glob. Thank goodness. Thank- <laughs> Oh my god. I can't stop laughing. That was insanity. Yeah. Oh, I that was pure just mayhem. Oh my lord. It is pure mayhem. Oh, oh, oh I'm on tears. Oh, that's <laughs> Dude, that was freaking nuts, man. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Uh, give me a moment. Some water. Wipe my tears. Oh, man. <laughs> That's so good. Oh, Lord. <clears throat> okay. Oh, hello, Monica. Okay. Everything's over. Now that weird situation is over, let's rest, shall we? That was so random, honestly. Mm-hmm, yeah. What a-hole would do that? <laughs> hey, Monica, I'm so thirsty. Could you get out that eggnog, please? You're always hungry or thirsty, Sayori, and I already got out an eggnog. Wait, what? Monica opens her bag. It's not in here either. Well, then where did it go? Who knows, Sayori? Who knows? What? What? <laughs> oh. It just went to black. <laughs> I was like, oh. <laughs> All right. I grab the jug of egg dog and take a large swish. Then I collapse on the bed, exhausted by the planning and running. Huh. Oh, <laughs> it's mom. Mom, oh. it's I. Hopefully, that's not mom. C. <laughs> I doubt it. But <laughs> <laughs> hey, honey, where are all the speakers? He said you were taking them to school for a project, right? Did you ever bring them home? Uh. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Project Earthquake, that's what it is. Exactly. Actually, no, that's a great name for a project. Eat a bag of dicks. <laughs> <laughs> Eat a bag artists. of dicks. Courtesy of the various artists. The <laughs> edition. It just closes out. All right. <laughs> and it closes out. <laughs> so, uh, that's uh, eggnog overload for you guys. And also... <laughs> Oh my god, that music is just oh god. <laughs> uh, so good and uh, sorry if we um destroyed or raped your ears or something or well ear rape and all. <laughs> oh, I just can't. I I can't, man. Oh. <laughs> hmm. 
So, uh, if you guys enjoyed what you're watching and like what you're seeing, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and of course subscribe if you haven't already. It'll help us make more content like this and click on the bell notification to be notified. And also, check out Killing Gaming, link in the description below. Tell him Finn sent ya. So yeah, um, let's see you guys on the next day, which is of course, the fourth day. On the third day of Christmas, VA sent to us Eggnog Overdrive, John Madden Deluxe And I gently opened the 